Okay, so we want to find the volume of the tetrahedron bounded by the coordinate planes and by this particular plane. So how do we do it? Well, drawing a picture is an excellent start. Here's a picture that, that, that I've drawn. This particular shape is, uh, has the volume that we're interested in. And if you look closely, you'll see that our region of interest lies above this shaded triangle in the xy plane. Why is that important? Because, well, to calculate the volume, we're going to integrate over this triangular region. Okay, so... So our region of interest lies above our triangle D. Okay, so I'm going to call this region D here. So the required volume is just double integral over d z da okay so to work this out we need to describe d a bit more precisely so let's transfer this down to the xy plane okay it's going to look a little bit like this and this is the line y equals 2 minus 2x. So if we want to transfer this line over into the three-dimensional setting, this line here is this line here. We're looking down the barrel of the z-axis. All right, so how do we describe d? Well, we can do it two ways, of course. Here I'm going to choose the following. I'm going to put x between two parallel lines and y between two non-parallel lines. So this is our description of D. Okay, so let's work out what our integral is. Z is just here. Okay, so making sure we put the differentials the correct way around. And then we just integrate the first, uh, the inside integral first, and then move on. So if we integrate with respect to y, this is what we get. Okay, so if we sub these values in now, we get something like the following integral. Okay, so now it's just up to us to evaluate this integral and you should get two thirds. Again, we're talking about volume, so we might want to specify some sort of cubic units here. So let's review what we've done here. We drew a picture. We looked at where the region of interest lies above in the xy plane. We described that region using Cartesian coordinates and then performed the integration.